What is up and good morning. Welcome to the South Florida Fishing Channel and today I am going fishing with a family of subscribers and they are out of Marathon, Florida. So originally they, they said we've been fishing three days, we couldn't catch anything. Can you come on our boat and maybe help us out? So I've never fished Marathon but I was up all last night looking at maps and reading about it and just trying to familiarize, familiarize, familiarize. I don't know if I'm saying that right. I'm trying to get familiar with the area. I'm gonna first stop at Worldwide Sportsman and see my buddy Phil, and I'm hoping Phil can hook me up with a new rod. Well, I just got a new rod. This one is specifically outfitted for flats fishing, bone fishing, some redfish maybe. I gotta say, I went into Worldwide Sportsman thinking I was gonna spend a certain amount of money, and I spent maybe twice as much as I thought I was going to. <clears throat> All right, we are here in Marathon, and this is my first time fishing Marathon. All right. Check out our crew. We got Hunter, Skyler, Jeremy, and I guess the goal is to catch a fish today. A fish. A fish. One fish, and we're doing good. <laughs> somewhere right now that's probably gonna be on the in the box later as we approach the ocean I notice the waves are getting pretty rough the perfect recipe for seasickness Woo! she's hammering hard I pick a spot off the reef that I thought looked decent but I don't really know what I'm doing drop her on down Hopefully we can get some ballyhoo for fresh bait. Wow, that's a lot of chain. Yeah, right. Just a little bit of chum. The ballyhoo have arrived. All right. Um, there's a big, um, you see that big one swimming right there? Yeah, it looks like two of them together. Yeah, they're, uh, it's a houndfish. Something much bigger. Yeah. Keep reeling in. Yep. Nope, it's going. Yeah. Okay, all right, stop there. All right, wait off. Yep. Keep reeling. Bring him on in. Yeehaw! Oh, what we got here? Grouper. There we go. A little red. Can open this bale here. All right. There he is. You want to hold him? <laughs> oh, I would. Not let your fingers go too deep in there, but if you like, yeah, right there. I do get several ballyhoo, but they keep their distance and we're hard to get, so we decide to move on. Unfortunately, it takes us about 30 minutes in wavy conditions to get the anchor unstuck. The recipe for seasickness is only getting better. That was, that was, um, glad, glad that's over with, man. It's too rough to troll, so I head to a wreck in 120 feet to do some bottom drifting. Butterfly ballyhoo.
Do it. Blowing chunks like a champ. Tossing chunks. Woo! <laughs> Sometimes I feel a lot better after I throw up, but only only for like 15 minutes and then I gotta throw up again. Woo! All right, yeah, reel it in. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, I think there's a fish on there. Yeehaw! I'm gonna mark that spot real quick. You feel a fish on there? Yeah. All right. Oh. Oh. There was a fish on there though. Yeah, I seen it. Talking. All right. Well. Okay. Thanks, so. <laughs> Next up. Next up. I thought there's something. Oh yeah. Yeah, that one's going. See that's. <laughs> it looks good. Hey, you went from throwing up to, to reeling in fish. Get me feeling better too. <laughs> nice. Like the most zombies caught me fish. Just hope whatever it is is keep. Oh yeah, I'm fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. All right, here comes the weight. Oh yeah, there's a fish on there. Oh, watch out, he's going for the engine. Oh, shark. He wasn't tugging like shark either. Yeah, he wasn't. Until he got up oh, near the top. Oh. Uh, he, he popped. He popped. Back in action. Back in action. Oh, yeah. Keep reeling. Yep, real, real, real. Oh, yeah, this is a fish, right? <laughs> this time there's a fish on it. The best way to hold it is put this hand like right there, yeah. There we go. I hope this is Anna. Oh, oh yeah. Uh, here, let me get. get I need to get the gas. Okay. Try to um, get him like off on, back on our side of the boat here. So. He... Oh shit! What happened here? Oh, it, it popped him off. Uh, it got caught on this metal piece. We know. Oh, dang it. Dang it. But what happened was it, he, he got clipped on that and it pulled the hook out of his mouth. It's all good. <laughs> Woo. We take the boat back up current to do that drift again. Come on, go back for it. Oh, yeah. I pushed stop instead of record, so I missed a freaking double hookup. But Skylar got a nice little mutton snapper and Hunter got a king mackerel for the ice box. Oh yeah, toss a few chunks. I just cut his throat so he starts bleeding. So that, see that I'm squirting blood? <laughs> Let me, um. Now that's proper way to bleed a kingfish. Yeah, you can just open that up. One fish in the box. All right, I'll put two new baits on here. We'll reposition and how many more drifts do you think you got in you? All day, buddy. <laughs> All day, yeah. Well, you know, as long as if you're sick, as long as you're not making everyone go home, then that is the best sick person there is. Getting some work in. Throwing up, catching fish, throwing up some more, cleaning the boat. That's professionalism. My ex girlfriend went from spearfishing with me to going full vegan. Oh. Dar Sizzle pulled up to the same spot we were fishing. She also has a YouTube channel. Who would have thought? Same day we're out here. the same long leader but they're they're 
Their weight doesn't pop off like ours, so they can't reel it in. <laughs> All right, we are back in action. Down she goes. Drifting this way. Our sizzle's right in our right in our way of where we want to drift. <laughs> but that's just typical out here, you know. Oh, I got it. Oh yeah? yeah. Fish on? Uh-oh. Oh no. Yeah, it was the bottom. Oh. It's... Yeah, reel it in anyways. There we go. <laughs> that was on a sardine too. Doing good, buddy. Trooper. All right. All right, real, real, real. Oh, it's huge. Is that a yellowtail? Or a yellowtail? Hey. Oh. What? Yeah. What nice. does he got there? He is. He's got both hooks in his mouth. <laughs> He's got that hook in his mouth too. He went. Oh man, I gotta reel this one in. That's a nice yellowtail. I can't believe he ate both. Hungry little thing. Don't let him go off the side of the boat now. Here, I'll just hold him in front of you. Like that. Beautiful. It's a good looking yellowtail. <laughs> Throw him in a box. We decide to head back to Marathon. And on the way back, we stop at the bridges and throw some shrimp on jig heads. We catch some snapper like this schoolmaster. And I even catch a bright blue parrotfish. We throw the fish back bloop, and made our way back to the house to cook up some yellowtail snapper. Candid camera moment. How are you doing? Good. <laughs> Say hi, Heiko. Hi, Heiko. <laughs> well, I was hoping you would flate so I don't have to do anything. <laughs> there it is. Yeah, sure. Hello. Now, how do you do this? Um, well, what. What fish are you used to flying? Like uh... none. Okay. Hmm. Beautiful. So I'll just cut them right down here in the head. I'm like, don't mess up, Heiko. The world's watching. Now I can. This is a really sharp knife. I need to get better at making my knives sharp. There we go. One fillet. I'd say medium, medium job. <laughs> no, it's all right. I'm gonna do the same to him. A really, really nice sharp knife. There's our two fillets and then our little yellowtail snapper, which is going to be fed to the crabs because the crabs need to eat too. It's only fair. So we'll check them over. All right, good to go. How's the uh, cucumber chopping going? It's amazing. It smells really good. The salad's gonna be amazing. <laughs> There's a whole bag of yellowtail that we caught off camera. It's nice. 
Yes. Where where is that from? Fish market? Fish market. Fish market. Five minutes away. Sound looks fire. Amazing. Okay. There's bones in these? Yep. We'll see. The ones we brought don't have any bones in them. They did not properly flay them. Yeah, So a little wishy wash and then nice and bready. With lemon. Oh, with lemon. Okay. Fancy. Do you not do the kingfish here? Uh, kingfish still in the cooler. Uh, That's a big one. Smokes. All right, I think it's time to uh, do the first bite here. Dun, 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 dun. Tastes like chicken. <laughs> <laughs> So you think the one we caught is better than the Definitely. store bought one? Definitely better than fish market. I agree. I have to agree on that. Mmm. Oh my god. god. Yes. You like it? Yes. Oh my god. That was... Hello. Uh, well, I didn't know fish If you didn't like notice, that. this you is the fish, the fish market yet? fish. Oh. Did you try that fish yet? <laughs> no. I <I'm> want <laughs> this one. My bad. I'm Which playing. one is... All right, is this one your guys's? No, you'll never, you'll never know. You're good. Lily! A little more crunchy. There you go. Mm. Well, you know, yeah. I, I eat for her too. Okay. Mm. Mm. Cucumber salad's really good with fish. Oh, you're doing the same thing. Yeah. It just looks like it's going to taste delicious. <laughs> mm -hmm. We haven't caught any fish and, and then now you came and you and we caught fish. <laughs> I think even though we only got two two fish for I it. think Kaigle's a lucky charm. Yeah. <laughs> what? That's I'm a that, lucky charm? That is this is <laughs> You're a lucky I do charm. Like, I do like lucky charm cereal. Subscribe to Hi No. <laughs> <laughs> Dang, look at that, I don't even have to say it. <laughs> his friends are his friends would be jealous because we fish and got two fish. And sure. also we my mom cooked the best. Oh. Yes, we have that. that. We have that on I'll camera. I'll that into a thing. And he's gonna be so embarrassed because <laughs> sometimes he just eats raw fish. <laughs> <laughs>